Well, today was our first day on the Clarence River, and we're at Camp One right now at Stoke Creek. And yep, it's been a pretty good day. No one's fell out yet, but Remy did. We came down the river with our whole family today. My cousin Kai, my husband Ruben, and my brother and sister, and Uncle Aaron, and Remy. Uh, we've got to do 180 kilometres on the river and it's going to take us about seven days. Uh, we've had a massive day on the river and um, we're tired and we're at slip camp now. Uh, Remy fell in about 16 times and went under the raft. We ran him over. But he survived and he still likes right. I don't know if you can see behind me, but Uncle Aaron is trying to catch a salmon, and I don't think we're going to eat tonight. No wants to mention this. Unbeaten track, you were Let's go fishing. See if Uncle Aaron caught a fish. We already caught one trout today. I can live with grace in this lonesome place. My door is vague, the answer. But I'll trust that it leads me. This is a teach me how to know why I come back here. and we're now at the muzzle and um, we've had a smaller day today and it's been really good and we're about to have a barbecue. The river was really good today, really clear and lots of fun. Looks like the weather, weather might be coming in a bit tonight but I hope we can get a clear run to the ocean. Baby, green and bear, sound of wind, bridge means ruined lately. Look me up just to cut me down I play the fool so ably I could come around from Lenny You could lay me down to rest I was just learning how to fly with a broken away You were lost, yearning for something to hold oh, I was just learning how to fly with a broken away Cause it's quite a thing 
up inside, baby station down to Snowgrass today and we've been through one of our most tra tra <laughs> challenging rapids. I'm here with Libby and Gigi and they've been showing us around the Clarence River. How long have you guys been guiding on the Clarence River? Well, this is both of our third season. Three years. You were in the river when the earthquake struck. What was it like? It was pretty scary. Definitely pretty scary. It woke us up quickly. We were all standing up running away from falling rocks pretty quickly. Yeah. We will. See you later, Lego man. <laughs> what? I've got green hair. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for noticing, Kiko. <laughs> 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 How's the river changed since the 7.8 earthquake? It's, it, we've seen a lot of changes, especially down here in the gorge. Um, we've had some pretty exciting rafting today through some new rapids that have been created by dams and rock falls and all sorts. Well, the earthquake created this amazing rapid down in the lower part of the river where it raised all of this new rock up and the river just carved its way through creating a really cool grade 3 drop. It's awesome. Thanks for being part of this video diary. Looking forward to tomorrow. It's okay. You woke up in the middle of the night because of an earthquake. It was around a 4.0 or something like that. It was like um, the heart getting lifted up and down by like waves or something. Rapids. Like as in like on the raft going through rapids. That poor Remy was scared. <laughs> he was like yelping. Our last day on the river was pretty good. Um, we had quite a few rainstorms coming through and we had a few campfires to warm us up and lots of warm food. The storm was really full on. You couldn't really see where you were going and there were lots of rocks falling down. I'm here with Ben Judge who runs with Clarence Rebuilt Rafting. <laughs> hey, how are you going? Glad you were on the river, not me yesterday. But it, but you had some nice warm weather at the start of the trip. Yeah. Has it been ch challenging running the operation after the earthquake? Has been challenging, here, but most most of the challenges from the earthquake have come a from uh, the logistics of travel, like road travel to get to our trip because we can't drive to Pakora and um, the on-river stuff has actually been not too bad and quite fun and exciting as well. Um, we've had a pretty quiet season because we did lose a lot of our trucks, um, mostly for those just the reasons. If you were going to go down a rapid, difficult rapid, who would you rather be at the so would G. <laughs> yeah, we saw that. Yeah. 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 
I don't, wouldn't even eat them. Maybe there's an awesome trip. Can't wait to do it again. Is that awesome? Thanks for coming. I'm a smile away from some, but I'm a mother away from her. has definitely got a, got some uh, work to do in the raft guiding department. He's not very good at staying in the boat actually. Seems to think that the waves are alive. Yeah. Tries to eat them. How many times did you fall off today though? One, only once, yeah. Rewell, what was your favourite thing in the trip?